certain questions, there, were, there are things I would like to explain, you know, why that, for instance, we, we start with the government, government department. Uh, Richard Ofori has been our number one for a long time until he got injured. Now he's back. He last had a very good performance. Uh, unfortunately, they lost, but, you know, I'm in good contact with him, which is he's shown us that he's ready, and uh, we are happy to have him back. At Izigi, the last, our last match did very well um, against uh, um, uh, Africos. He proven, he's proven over the time that we can rely on him. Manav Nuruddin, who is a new young man coming into the, into the squad, he was once with under 20s, uh, I think if I remember very well, Jim Kobla was in the squad. He's gone to Belgium, he's performed so well, he's done so well, and I think, uh, like I said, uh, he deserves a chance and we'll give him that chance. Of course, Richard Atta, who has been superb for Hearts of Folk, uh, he's had over 14 clean sheets, maybe you can correct me, and, and I think it's his first time, he's also deserved uh, a call up. Benson Annan, you know his name. Um, the other day I was here, he was sent to the Japan squad, now he's back. And the Yadom, I don't need to explain, Baba Rahman, Gideon Mensah, and of course, uh, Philemon Balfour, which we all, we all uh, uh, know. Of course, um, Alessandra Jiku, Daniel Mate, Ishmael Ganyu are known faces. Um, of course, Jonathan Mensah is also a known face, but he's been out for a couple of times, you know, maybe a year or so. Now he's back because he's been very, very consistent with his performance. It's Orlando uh, uh, Columbus, yeah. He's, Columbus, yeah. Uh, he's done so well. And uh, I think uh, in replacement, maybe I, I would say that uh, we know that Nicolas Opoko is injured. He will be back probably maybe January or February. And so uh, we need another strong person to fill in that bit. And Jonathan Mensah is in. And we are happy he is, he is with us. Of course, with the midfielders, we have uh, Mubarak Wakaso, uh, Idris Ubaba, Emmanuel Lomote, Thomas Pate. One may ask, we are monitoring <laughs> with Pate. Okay? I spoke to him yesterday, and it's clear uh, when he's fit, very important player, he, he, can, he can join us. Kamal Din uh, Suleiman, who just moved from uh, Nordjylland to Rennes, he's done well, had a good start. And I think uh, he's one of the guys we believe that uh, our hope for the future is, is, is good. Uh, Samuel Wusu, Emmanuel JC, Tariq Fosu, Isahaku, Fatau, I think they are familiar faces. So, with attacking uh, midfielders, we have Majid Ashimero, who's been with us but never had a chance to, uh, to start or to play. We were in Sudan, he was with us in Sudan. Uh, unfortunately, this time it was uh, before we played our last two friendlies. He was injured, so he couldn't join. And now he's here with us. Uh, Kudus Mohammed, who has had a, a, a little bit of injury, we believe that by the time um, we we'll assemble, he will he'll be ready. A free Ebanye, talented player, brave guy, done so well. This isn't seen him a couple of times. He deserves to be here. Andre Ayu, our captain who just moved to uh, the Arab world. I believe in his judgment. His, uh, his father is also one experienced man, and I believe in their judgment, and it's a very important uh, move he's made, and so no doubt. John Ayu, Kwame Poku, we know, we are aware of them. Kelvin Yebua, a new dynamic striker who within three matches scored two goals in Australian League. Australian League. Um, I hear a lot. We've been looking for goal scorers, goal scorers. This is one guy, I believe, one, once we encourage him, he will, he will and fit in, in the way we play, understands everything, he will be of uh, good use to us in the near uh, future. So these are the reasons why, my opinion, why these names are here.